On 4th June, the Ministry of Health announced 35 new cases of COVID-19, the highest total over the last three months. According to the results, the number of the cumulative coronavirus infections currently stands at 165,700 since the pandemic first hit in March 2020. In a tweet by the Minister of Health, Dr. Jen Ruth Acheng, the increase is similar to the rise in COVID-19 cases faced in June 2021 when the Delta variant was prevalent. Senior Public Relations Officer in the Minister of Health, Emmanuel Ineviolna, says, as the ministry, they are prepared to respond in case of a surge. As a ministry, we have built uh, capacity over time to manage uh, COVID-19. What we call upon the population is to ensure that they get vaccinated. If you have not been vaccinated, if you are elderly and you are at risk and vulnerable and you have not taken your booster shot, endeavor to take your booster shot. Uh, that is all we can say right now, but encourage people to follow standard operating procedures. Yes, Inebiona also advises Ugandans to continue wearing face masks again. Wash hands, get vaccinated if you haven't, take your second shot if you haven't. If you are 50 and above and you haven't taken a booster shot, take your booster shot to better protect yourself. The ministry also says that it will continue to monitor the situation and that the government is not about to impose travel restrictions and a lockdown. Take a genomic sequencing at the Uganda Virus Research Institute to know whether we have a new strain or it is the similar variants already experienced. But there we call for calm. There shouldn't be, there is no cause for alarm at the moment. Following the reduction in daily cases, government relaxed COVID-19 restrictions in April this year. Fully vaccinated members of the public are currently not required to wear face masks when they are outdoors, provided there are no crowds. Shamim Natewa with Tendo, CTV.